No leaks. No. No leaks. Hi, Monroe. Now that is a big ass piece of concrete. Yeah. I could barely pick it up with the uh, excavator. Maybe you could pick it up with the with the big scoop. Mm hmm I just uh But that can just be put somewhere over here. I don't I don't really want to look at it, no. I'd yeah. rather have it back in the ground, to be honest mm. with you. I mean mm -hmm. I don't want to put it necessarily back on top of here, but maybe it would can be. Can we better. just can we just cover it up with some dirt? From over there? Well, how about if we use it to build up this turnaround? So like yeah, that's what we should do. So I wanna so I wanna be able to pull up around here, right? And then be able to turn around on the property. Some really big rocks to take up volume through here. Yeah. And then just start piling sand on top.
Almost. <laughs> yeah, the back tires. I also was thinking four wheel drive home, I don't know. Four wheel drive. Yeah. Round two. Yeah. Nice. It's got to be a little wider. Keep coming. What's that? Yeah.
Is he gonna make it? Oh shit! All right, so we are going to go get some gravel to put on this uh, new loop-de-loop -loop driveway. Uh, we're going to try to throw five tons of gravel on this area, grade it all in. Hopefully that will make this uh, a little bit more solid.
Coyote. It's a big one. Oh wow, is he eating something? Oh, that coyote is chowing down. He's got some dinner. Run off into the sunset. All right, it's safe to get out, I think. Oh yeah, I can see it leaking. Oh yeah, it's just dripping out of there. To get this bucket off. I'm gonna do a couple other things um, as well, like get these. I got some big old rocks stuck in here, so I'm gonna try to get those out. But ultimately, I want to try to get this plate off here because that seems to be hiding those hydraulic hoses. And from what look at all these rocks, I just got a bunch of rocks shoved back in here. So, um, I feel like one of those rocks is just pinched through whatever hose is back there. Doesn't look like maybe too big of an issue, but uh, you know, I've never done this before, so let's get the bucket off and tear this thing apart. So now I just got to get these bolts off and see what surprises we have. Alright, so I think I may have lucked out here. Um, I got all this clean in here and I'm uh, just kind of testing all these fittings and this one is Lucy Goosey. See that? So, checking the rest of these. This should be tight for sure. This one's tight, this one's tight. I'll just get a wrench and make sure all these are tight. Um, I don't see any breaks in these lines at all. And this is exactly where it seemed to have been leaking. So I think we're in good shape. I may not be replacing a uh, hose right now, although this hose has been taking a beating. For some reason, it's got this elbow here and it just, it's going to, at some point this hose is gonna, is gonna bust here because it's just constantly rubbing on all this metal. This is good Good still. I'm happy about this. Let's uh, get these tightened up and test it out. Alright, so I got, uh, this guy was loose here, 
So I tightened it up and this is all clean. Let's start it up, see if uh, there's any leaks. I think we're good. Now that the uh, hydraulic leak is fixed here, and I didn't have to replace any hoses, time to get back to work. Alright, well, it has been raining, 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 which is good, because the desert needs the rain, and um, so did that little driveway turnaround, because that sand is super soft, and uh, we're going to go dump some rock on it, harden it up a bit. bucket right there. on the way down. I love these new tracks, they feel nice. All right, we're going up the outside. Good for the drive. Maybe I'll try to tight tight on the inside this time.
shaky, shaky. Clam this one. I'm clamming it. It's looking like a driveway. is kind of tricky to get. out a little bit with the full weight of all this gravel in the bucket I'll float it on the way down and hopefully compact it a little bit more than I would be with an empty bucket Disaster up there with that power line.
and that was a little too fast. Gotta do one more pass. Go, maybe I'll go closer to the inside. A little bit slower. Okay, much better. Much better. And that's it. Let's go see what that looks like. Alright, well. This is the five tons of rock here. Probably a little bit more than that, actually. And uh, it definitely feels a lot more solid. I mean, there's a ton of rock in here. It's going to keep settling over time, so... Probably not finished, but um, you know, I think I think this is gonna work for now. Maybe we can throw some more some more dirt on it uh, after the next rain. But uh, yeah, looks good. On to the next one. Yeah.